Tough loss to MNU today, Jackson. Uh, team got off to a little bit of a slow start there in the first quarter. What do you think needed to go differently there? Um, you know, we were missing some pieces on uh, defense, which provides a big loss, but guys were stepping in playing well. I mean, we just had a few miscues. I mean, the high snap, some penalties that may or may not have been penalties on the first drive. So, you know, we knew we could do it, but just some some things that didn't swing our way. Uh, the drive to time, tie the game 31-31. Just how much confidence does that give you and the team knowing that in a situation like that, you can drive down the field and get a score? You know, it's good. We, uh, we failed on some of those two-minute drives earlier in the season, a couple of them. So it feels good to do it, but, you know, left a little too much time on the clock for them. But, you know, it's all right. It's all right. The sun will shine again. All right. Thanks, Jackson. Yeah. 38-31 loss today. Coach, uh, just what do you think was the biggest difference maker in this game? You know, I thought the slow start, you know, getting down 21 nothing, that, that was tough to overcome. And then, you know, the second half, we, we had some drives stall out and, you know, getting that blocked field goal. And, and then, you know, just we got to make a play there, and, and it didn't happen. And uh, credit to MNU for making plays. And, uh, you know, it was, it was a game all the way down to the end. And, and uh, But I'm proud of our kids, you know, no quit mentality, uh, great attitudes about everything, and, and it, we just fell a little short today. What is it about MNU's passing game that makes it so tough on defenses? I think the quarterback does a good job distributing the ball. They got really good athletes, and, and they just kids made a lot of plays today. And you know, give those guys credit. All right, thanks, coach. Thank you.